welcome, folks. This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day on the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Make it a great night, folks. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 139, NASDAQ up 183, SP's up 36. Gold, gold contract up $43.20 trading at 2,585 an ounce. We have silver up $1.21 at $30.14. Light sweet crude up a buck 82, $69.13 a barrel. Notes and bonds. 10 year note down four ticks, trading 115.06. The 30 year down 12 at 126. 13 and king dollar king dollars pulling back 300 and where are you baby 335 at 101 350 euro is at 110 yens at 48 british pounds at 131 to 1 us dollar now normally folks i'd say the phone number but bottom line is that we're going to be doing skype and we're just not set up just yet we will we are or we're not okay this will take us a couple more days we move the office a great move, thank God. We're still moving the office. The trip in itself, no doubt. Let's get over to our man, Mr. Basil Chapman. And don't forget, Basil has a great show here every trading day, 10 to 11 Eastern Standard Time. Also, it's a great news, uh, the opening call. Now, it's very easy to get the opening call. Come over to our website, at TFNN. You go under newsletters. You'll see it right on the left-hand side of the opening call. You can sign up, and you can ride this wave each and every day. Basil Chapman, what's going on, brother? Don't have them yet. Okay. Well, I know we'll get. We, there'll be some glitches here, folks. Unfortunately. Um, anyway. Okay. So market-wise, folks, just let just put Basil on when you have Mel. Okay. Uh, market-wise, what we had out here is this: is that yesterday. You rejected lower price. Then you had a surge of volume. Bottom line, higher wide price spread, accelerated volume. That's a sign of strength. That's saying S and P's want to go to the high. Right now we're up four dollars twenty cents at five fifty eight sixty. We go take a look at the Q's. Q's are a different ball game still. You know, last time up we didn't make the high. Uh, I suspect what you're going to see here. I suspect we'll make the last, the first high. Meaning, no, the last high, not the first high. So we're at 473.41 right now. 485 is the number. I expect we're going to get there. And then, and the gold contract, this is a big number on the gold contract. So gold, we've been running sideways for three weeks. You broke topside today and you had the volume, 213,000 contracts, okay? So what we have here is this. Let's do these numbers, okay? So I got... 2564, and I'm going to have bigger screens, so it's going to be easier, folks, for me to get to look at this. This is, anyway, 20, 2564, and the A is on this, which is 2398. So you get a 166 A to B, and you see is... 2502. So that gives you 2668. That's your next move. And that's a one to one. Now, something you want to remember inside the gold market when gold starts running, it loves running from a 1 to 1.382 to a 1.50 ABC structure on the way up and on the way down. Now we're going on the way up, of course. But that's how this thing normally lays out. And I expect that's exactly what we're going to get. You know, you have a surge. Um, you have a surge right now in, in volume and all the equities. Bottom line, it's going to go. The dollar is still going to be kind of interesting here. The reason being is that, you know, we're down today, but that dollar has been building cause for higher price. Now, the, the, gold comp, the gold business just pushed it away today. We go to the silver market. We take a look at silver. And we have with silver, huge price spread. Nice, 72,000 contracts. Now the silver has not broken its downtrend yet. Still in the downtrend. 
you know, we get another day like tomorrow, that, that, that downtrend is going to be broken. And then that'll set up silver making a run to the 32.44 again, not the high. The high right now generated out there is the 33.50. Uh, if we go take a look at the SLV, and we see how the SLV set up, that's going to need more volume too, man. 17 million is not bad. I mean, last swing high out here only had 8.8 .8 million. So it's a start. That's the bottom line. If we go take a look at Hecla, Hecla trading right now up uh, 50 cents. Oh, yeah, Hecla's happening, man. Oh, this is a break top side. Okay, let's go take a look at Hecla. Put that on a three year weekly. Oh, this is a good number, man. So Hecla's on its way to, we're at 648, 697. Actually, it's on its way to 740, 760. Eckler's on its way to 760 right now, and you're 649. Put this on a monthly. Yeah, same setup. Same setup. We'll see what happens with that $7 mark, but the, the last high in this happens to be in the nines. And I suspect, you know, we'll, we'll see how this. Uh, We'll see how this works out. And unfortunately, um, yeah, well, we'll, ah, sorry about that, folks. What's happening is that these screens are off to my left, which doesn't work because every time I get to move my neck, I get a cramp. Anyway, it is what it is. That'll all change, too. That'll all change, too. I'm telling you, we're just happy to be out of the black mold deal. That was like insanity which we didn't even know. It was eating us alive, and we didn't even know it. The um, Newmont, we take a look at Newmont. Newmont is breaking top side also. One second. Let's go. No, not quite yet. OK, so Newmont's up $2.30. We put this on a weekly. This is on its way. The 55 level, the 53.03 right now. 